So I got a Corvette and today's video, we're moving along on the suspension removal. Um, we're gonna be taking apart uh, sway bar end link. Now I was intending originally uh, to rebuild or, you know, put new bushings in the sway bars um, or the end links, but I think I'm gonna upgrade the sway bar and the end link to a solid or, uh, you know, one of them fancy ones uh, that, are, that are adjustable. I'm thinking about doing that. Uh, so I'm not gonna be replacing the bushings on this because I'm just gonna upgrade anyway. So um, in order to get this suspension to drop all the way down, what we need to do is we need to get these two bolts out. So let's get going on that. And uh, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's get become uh, an accomplished, uh, award-winning novelist, I guess. <laughs> so, uh, 15 millimeter uh, socket and a 15 millimeter wrench there. Uh, I'm probably gonna have to go get in the car and get my 15 millimeter that's on the ground over there because I left it over there. Or actually not because I've got it right here. All right, so what we're gonna do here, 15 millimeter, lefty loosey, righty tidy. Nothing crazy. Just hold the hold the bolt on the back side. Now you can do this in the car. It's not gonna be that big of a deal doing it in the car. Um, you know, always a, always an option to do that. Um, but personally, uh, since I'm doing the removal of the entire suspension assembly, I'm just kind of doing it. Uh, deep will probably be better for this one, but I got a good bite on it. <clears throat> so here we go. Ah, yes, that's a little bit tighter. Oh, oh, drop it through all the grease and everything. Ah. You want to have a jack underneath the lower control arm or or something, that way you can lift the tension off of the suspension so you can get the bolts out. So, we're gonna do that right now. I can't push the, the bolts out, well, almost can, but we're gonna lift it up a little bit, uh, take some tension off of that suspension. And we're gonna have to go down with it, I think. Nice and easy, because All right, there's one. All right, now we can get the other one because we got tension off of this, the assembly. All right, there we go. That's that. Now, keep in mind, I took it off because if there is a preferential side to it, you don't wanna, you don't wanna mess it up. So anyway, if you guys have any questions, comments or whatever on that, uh, you're more than welcome to leave a comment in the comment section. The next order of business for this car is gonna be removing the lower control arm, and we're gonna be doing that here in just a minute. But yeah, anyway, I'll catch you in the next one.